been two weeks, 336 hours, 20,160 minutes, and 1,209,600 seconds since the greatest artist of our generation, Sugar Hill Kim, was sentenced. I got Boca the night, same thing. How he came out, same thing. Nigga, you a bummer, you shoot BK. What the fuck, what the fuck on my face? You not over. Yeah. I got Boca the night, came out, same thing. Yo, right, and you shoot EK. You not over. Get the fuck on my face. Keem wasn't exactly the most lyrical artist, but that doesn't change the fact he was the greatest of all time. I mean, who else would actually have the nerve to diss Cardi B? Cardi B, who the fuck is you? You a thought you getting it too. I see Cardi B in the booth. Now look, like, Cardi B, when I see better move. Inspiring footage indeed. One thing I'll miss about Kim is his funny aura and his music. He isn't even saying shit most of the time, but that shit will make you move. And look, I'll tell you that for free. Another unknown fact is that Sugar Hill King was the first Bronx Harlem drill rapper to use a Jersey Club beat. He was truly revolutionary. His lowest viewed music video on his channel is on over half a million views. I believe if he was out, he would be going up. Look at this shit. I think for me, Rock Nation offered that man 1.6. Niggas mm. don't know that. Mm. Rock Nation offered that man 1.6. Mm. Before he could sign, you feel me, got in trouble with the law, you feel me? So mm. it is what it is, but that's 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 the, the real story about it. But so yeah. you saying so so no, nah, that's a drop though. So you yeah. saying so Keen. Shigel Keen. Keem had a 1.6 on the table. I ain't gonna lie, he about to be tight, but yeah, I had 1.6. He did. Bad. Well, I mean, and I'm be honest, that that that's not far fetched, though. I mean, nah, if you know what's going on, that's not far fetched. 1.6. That's not far. -fetched. Rock Nation, Jay Z's label, offered Sugar Hill Kim 1.6 million to sign. This isn't far fetched. Keem makes songs for clubs and parties, which is where the money is at, and he's still going crazy on TikTok. Such stupidity. Flashing a gun on live when he was just on a case with block work over a gun. The hip hop police were on this live and arrested him a couple hours later. Okay, you got it. Hey, Brock. What's going on? Hey, uh, we got good and bad news. Good news, we got your payment, buddy. Bad news, uh, they gave you life. <laughs> Sayonara. <laughs> Five years for a gun charge is outrageous. He must have had Drewski defend him. But look on the bright side. Hopefully he uses this time to reflect and expand his vocabulary. He's also still young. He's 21. He can come out at 25 or 26 and start over again. I'll be waiting for him. I am sorry, my mentor. I have failed you. <laughs>